Welcome to Daily Success, where each day we discuss ideas, insights, and strategies to help you become a better version of yourself and to not only survive, but thrive in the modern world. Here's your success guide, Parth Sahani. Hello, success heads. On Thursdays, we read a meditation from the book, An Apple a Day, 366 Meditations on Growth, Persistence, and the Art of Exceptional Living written by yours truly. Here is today's entry from the book. October 10th, share your unique gift with the world. We have been trained by our society to believe that we can do anything we want, that we can have all the things we desire and bring them into our lives. But if we live that way, we let go of excellence, joy, peace and freedom. Having too many things in our lives makes us stressed and miserable and pursuing different things at the same time makes us mediocre in each of them. We have to stop running like a headless chicken and get ourselves going in one direction. We have to eject ourselves out of the hamster wheel and bring intention into our pursuits. Also, we can't rely on other people to live a happy and joyous life. If we do, we set ourselves up for despair, disappointment and frustration. We can't trust the marketers They just want to sell their products to us so that we can fix our lives. They want us to buy things left, right and center with countless credit card swipes to change ourselves and our lives. We can't trust the government and the politicians to make our lives better and great again. We can't let them control our lives and dictate the level of success and joy we experience in our lifetime. And we certainly can't give up and give in and leave everything to God or the universe reacting to life as it happens, becoming a couch potato, watching Netflix all day long and waiting for checks to show up in our mailbox. The law of attraction doesn't work this way. Always remember, the last three letters of the word attract are A-C-T, act. There's no attraction without action. No one can make our lives better and make us more successful in this journey of life. We don't owe the world anything. The only thing we are truly entitled to in this amazing human adventure is the power to design our own lives. As Darren Hardy points out, what you have been endowed with is an incredible power to create, to make, to work for the life that you want to live. The only person who can take you and your life to the next level is you. You have to take charge of your life. You have to take ownership of your success and the life that you are creating for yourself. You have to figure out your own unique gift, the one that you're exceptional at, the one that helps you stand out, the one that makes you awesome, and work to cultivate mastery in it. You have to pursue that one thing vigorously and work towards sharing that gift with the world. As we find a way to add immense value to the world through our genius, we equip ourselves to carve our own destiny and design the life and lifestyle we truly want to live and embody. I hope you enjoyed today's insight. You can get a copy of An Apple a Day at your favorite store. Just go to bookstory.com forward slash daily dash apple. Again, it's books number two, read.com forward slash daily dash apple. I'll also add this link in the show notes. That wraps up this episode. Have a tremendous Thursday and I'll talk to you soon. Until next time, relax, stay calm and keep moving forward. We hope today's episode added incredible value to you. For more helpful resources on personal development, philosophy and holistic success, come visit ParthSahani.com. Have an amazing day.